Hello, I am Nurul Athar, PMP, CPHIMS and ITEL certified and welcome to my presentation. In this presentation, I am going to talk about Health Information Technology abbreviation and its meaning starting with letter A. AHIMA, American Health Information Management Association. American Health Information Management Association. The American Health Information Management Association is a professional association for health professionals involved with involved in health information management needed to deliver quality health care to the public. Now see ASP application service provider. An application service provider is a business providing computer based services to customer over a network such as access to particular software application using a standard protocol. ALOS Average length of stay Average length of stay The average length of stay is calculated by adding the total length of stay for each discharge resident in month and divided, dividing by the number of discharge resident in a month. The average length of stay can be calculated for the entire facility or by a specialty unit per program. So how total length of stay calculated? 6 plus 11 plus 5 plus 8 is equal to total and average length of stay is total number of stay divided by total number of discharges. In this case total number of stay is 30 days and total number of discharges is R4. So if we divide 30 by 4 we will get 7.5 average length of stay days. Now see AR account receivable account receivable account receivable or legally enforceable claims for payment held by business for goods are supplied or services rendered that customer have ordered but not paid for these are generally in form of invoices raised by a business and delivered to the customer for payment within an agreed time frame now see what is abn abn stand for advance beneficiary notice you may get a written notice called an Advance Beneficiary Notice of Non-Coverage ABN from your doctor, other healthcare provider or supplier. If you have original Medicare and your doctor pro provider or supplier thinks Medicare probably or certainly won't pay for the item or services you got. Now see AHRQ stand for Agency for Healthcare Research and Quality. The Agency for Healthcare Research and Quality is one of 12 agencies within United States Department of Health and Human Services. The agency is, is headquartered in North Bethesda, Maryland, a suburb of Washington, D.C. Now let's see what is AARA, American Recovery and Reinvestment Act. The American Recovery and Re Reinvestment Act, A. RRA was massive round of federal spending intent to create new jobs and recover job lost in Great Recession of 2008. This government spending was to compensate for a slowdown in private investment in that year. Now see what is ASTM, American Society for Testing and Material. ASTM International, formerly known as American Society for Testing and Materials, is an international standard organization that develops and publishes voluntary consensus technical standards for a wide range of materials, products, systems, and services. Now, the ACA Affordable Care Act. The Affordable Care Act (ACA), also known as Obamacare, was signed into law in March 2010. It was designed to extend health coverage to millions of uninsured Americans by legally requiring them to buy health insurance. ACO Accountable Care Organization Accountable Care Organizations ACOs are a group of doctors, hospitals and other health care providers who come together voluntarily to give coordinated high quality care to the many care patient they serve. API stand for application forum interface 
API stands for Application Programming Interface. An API is a software intermediary that allows two applications to talk to each other. In other words, an API is the messenger that delivers your request to provider that you are re requesting it from and then delivers the response back to you. Okay, that brings us to end of my presentation. Thank you for watching. I hope you would have found this information useful. If you like my videos, please subscribe to my channel.